So guys, this is Gayla, and she's best known for I want a hit for Pyramus Christmas, only him But, um, so question for you is, um, which you kind of just answered, I see you still sing. Yeah, somewhat. Somewhat. Hey, it's still beautiful. Um, so how, um, so you were 10 years old when you sang yes. the song? Yep, I was 10 years old. What was the reaction back then? Did you get like big reactions from everybody? Oh yeah, it was, uh, it, once it was released, I introduced the, the song on the Ed Sullivan Show, which was a big deal. Once you're on the Ed Sullivan Show, everybody watched that. It's kind of like the, the yeah, it was like these. Watched, gathered around the TV every week. So uh, that launched the record, and it just became a big hit. And that's it. That's awesome. And I see you actually did get to see an actual hippopotamus. I actually got a hippopotamus for Christmas. It was uh, the money was raised by boys and girls sending their money in from all over the state of Oklahoma, where I lived at the time. And by Christmas, they had raised enough money to actually buy a live hippopotamus, fly her into Oklahoma City, and present her to me on Christmas Eve morning. <laughs> and her name was Matilda. That's her. She was kind of a baby. So how long did you have Matilda for? Well, I couldn't keep her in my house or the so, garage. Not the garage? Not the garage, oh. like the song said. No. So I donated her to the Oklahoma yeah. City Zoo. And they housed her for 49 years. Happily, she uh, she married Norm, and they had nine babies. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's amazing. Um, so what was, um, how did that come apart? Like, the actual, like, did they, like, the, like, singing the song and stuff? Like, did you audition? Oh, well, no, I had already been, uh, singing on television for since I was eight years old okay. in Oklahoma City on two different TV shows. We did a lot of touring and singing, and so I was already pretty established as a, uh, a singer by, by that time. And then I got a record contract uh, from Columbia Records, and the very first song that was brought to me by Mitch Miller was I Want to Hit the Promise for Christmas. And you got one for Christmas. And That's I actually got one for Christmas. I like it. Well, thank you so much for your time. I hope you enjoy this weekend. Thank you. Yeah.